Follow these steps to replace your GVC2 control board. First, be sure to power off your machine. Then, remove the cover from the slots like this. Note that your board may be mounted differently and be blue or green. However, the operation will be the same. We recommend snapping a picture of the control board connection so you know where to reconnect everything. Now you can disconnect the wires for the motors, shelves, and common wires, temperature sensor relay, door switch, delivery sensor, keypad, decks, MDB, power, and display. Unhook the control board from the six standoffs holding it in place. There are three on each side. Place the new control board on, attaching it to the six standoffs. Then attach the connections to the control board, just like you found it. Finally, place the cover in the slots like so. After replacing a board, you need to do a motor count and reset basic settings such as refrigeration and motor modes. Any other specialty settings such as timers will need to be reprogrammed as well. 